Today, we are telling scary stories from the closing table. What's more scary than someone trying to pretend to be someone else? Well, when an innocent person guesses something's up, but says nothing. You have heard us warn of bad actors impersonating sellers and getting unsuspecting realtors to join in on that fraudulent sale. These impersonators are really good and have taken us all the way to the closing table. Alarming to us? When discovering late in the transaction that the so-called seller is an impersonator and we inform the listing agent, the listing agent tells us, hmm, I thought something was fishy. We all need to play our part in stopping these schemes. Number two, when engaging a buyer client, some realtors explain their service is free to the buyer. Frightening. Your services are not free. In fact, they are very valuable. If the seller doesn't pay, the buyer will. Three, a T47 affidavit is signed stating no changes were made since the existing survey was drawn. The existing survey is decades old. The fence shown on the survey was already several years old when the survey was done. Has no one replaced that fence? And if so, how did they handle working around the trees that have grown since that survey was done? No changes? Sounds a little hairy to me. And number four, don't you think it's spooky when an affidavit of airship somehow conveniently misses a son of deceased parents? But the obituary lists his name. He may never have helped with the ailing parents' care and bills, but he didn't turn into a ghost. That estranged son owns some of that property. Happy Halloween to all of you.